Our next guest is the owner of The Book Man, a Chilliwack bookstore that's been a beloved fixture in the community for more than two decades. After seeing their customers interact so positively with their adorable resident cat, Beatrix, they partnered with the local rescue agencies to start a cat adoption program. This is awesome. You can check out the kitties right now, like in the store window. This is how it works. And follow up inside if you'd like to give that cat a forever home. Amber Price, owner of The Book Man, joins us now with more good morning to you. Good morning, Lindsay. Thanks so much for having me. Oh, what a great idea. Okay, so tell us a little bit more about the cat adoption program and how it works. For sure. So as you mentioned, we're partnered with local rescue agencies and they place adoptable cats in the bookstore that people can come and meet. They sleep in the cat window at night and then during the day they wander the aisles meeting and greeting customers and hopefully winning over hearts and earning a forever home. So literally people can walk by and look through this cat window and they can see the cat that they could potentially go home with. Absolutely. Wow. And all of the adoption information is online and you can QR code to that from the outside as well. I find that Amber that part really cool. So there's a QR code. So if you see the cat and you're like, oh my gosh, I want to know more information or I want to adopt this cat, you just scan the, Q the QR code, right? Exactly. Yep. It's awesome. And so how many cats are available for adoption at one time? Well, we had one for our inaugural bookstore adoptive cat and Butters went home to his new home on Saturday. Oh, wow. I'm delighted to say and we now have a pair bonded set of siblings named Jesse and James who are living <laughs> in the world, and they are charming the pants off of everybody that they meet. Okay, so what do we know about Jesse and James? Tell us about them. Well, they're about six months old. They're very confident, affectionate, and playful. They love to interact with people, and they've both got great motors. Of course, they're dressed for success in their tuxedos as well. They're really cute. <laughs> they're really, really cute. What has the reaction been like from people, from your customers and from the community? It's been overwhelmingly positive. I, of course, really love seeing senior citizens come in as a cat, especially those that can't have pets in their buildings. Mm. So they really belong to everybody, their community cats, for the duration of their visit at the bookstore. And then, of course, some lucky person gets to take them home at the end of their adventure. Okay, but we have to talk about Beatrix because uh, that cat has been, that was, that's the resident cat in the store, right? So tell, tell me about Beatrix first. Yeah, so Beatrix has been with us for a few years. We discovered her out back of the bookstore. She was abandoned and living underneath a building next door to the bookstore. Aww. We coaxed her out, got her some much needed medical attention, and she has been sauntering up and down the aisles very sassily ever since. Uh, she's a uh, a very popular cat, lots of people love her. She's featured in tons of Instagram accounts Aww. and people love the social media interaction with her. Okay, but this has been her space and now there are other cats in town in her space. How is she <laughs> reacting to the other cats? The interlopers. Well, it's a 5,000 <laughs> square foot store, so oh, wow. there's lots of space to go and hide. She's very <laughs> adept at climbing bookshelves, so she'll just go up on high and kind of look down disdainfully when she needs some space. And at night, they go to their respective cat rooms, so there's no uh, mischief or shenanigans in the evening. <laughs> uh, Amber, it's such a great idea. I love that you guys are doing this, and it sounds like it's just so successful right out of the gate, and hopefully we'll continue that way. Amber Price, thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Have a great day. All right. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.